we're talking historic flooding, flooding not seen since before 2004 when they dealt with Francis and Hurricane Ivan. began to rise a whole lot faster than I have ever saw it rise here in our county. More than 30 people are missing in the Crusoe area of Haywood County. That is a small area of Haywood County, and again, 30 people unaccounted for. On August 17, 2021, Tropical Depression Fred dumped 11 inches of rain on Haywood County. It was a two-day total not seen in 50 years that wreaked havoc on homes and roads, causing major flooding and rock slides across the area. The Pigeon River nearly reached 20 feet in depth, flooding Canton, Clyde, Bethel, and devastating the Caruso community. On August 19th, two lives were lost and 20 were still unaccounted for. First responders from all over the state came together to help, searching for people, rebuilding roads, and providing aid. The county united in its darkest time, becoming Haywood Strong. So when I started out this morning uh, and started thinking about filming a video, I wanted to do something fun and funny. Uh, something about cycling like I've been doing a lot lately more on my fat to fit journey and I, when I got off work I got the idea that I'm gonna just go and see if I can even drive up to the sunburst campground where I'm planning on doing my bike packing trip I couldn't get within 10 miles of it and the more that I drove around and just saw what was going on it literally broke my heart We've been very lucky. We live, you can tell, we live up on a really big hill in the middle of town. So water got nowhere near here. We had a tiny bit of water get into our basement just where it flowed down through the yard. But we had nothing, nothing compared to what happened further out in Caruso and Bethel and those places. They, the level of devastation out there is just heartbreaking. But when I started editing this, I didn't feel right about making money off this video. Whether it gets 100 views or 10 views or a million views, I didn't feel right about making money off of other people's suffering. So what I decided to do instead, if you look in the description down below, there is a list of websites that you can go to that are set up to help the people of Haywood County, people that have lost their homes, that have lost their pets, their family, their friends. People have literally died. There's still 20, as, as of right now, there's still 20 people that are missing. There's no telling if they're even alive or where if they'll ever be found. Also, I also wanted to think of a way that we could help as much as we could. I mean, we couldn't like go out and help clean up and do other stuff like that, but the we did want to give back to the community that we live in so I designed this sticker everything right now is Haywood strong um, Haywood County has come together and is helping everyone immensely and it's incredible so I designed this sticker this will actually be uh, you can get it in white vinyl or black vinyl it would be more like can you see that it'd be like that in the black vinyl um, to go on your car It'll be weatherproof vinyl, $5 for every sticker, and all the proceeds will be donated to go to Haywood County to help people who have just been, I mean, I can't think of a, a, what else to say, people that have been devastated by what has happened in Haywood County in the last couple days. Whether you're from Haywood County or whether you're from Timbuktu, there is a subscriber in Timbuktu, um, yeah five bucks 
shoot me an email I'll put a link down below also for my email just send me an email tell me how many you want let's sell a hundred of these that would be five hundred dollars that we could donate as a team as a family on YouTube to Haywood County to help people that have lost so much like I always say, that's the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. If, if you want to help out, just like the video, and then that'll get it up in the algorithms. If you share it, that'll help us get more people to buy stickers and more money that we can donate to help others. And if you're new, subscribe. We do fun stuff here too in Haywood County. It's not always floods and terribleness. Lately it has been, but it's not always. Thanks, guys.